Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel at Knowledge Hub. If you are a Power BI enthusiast like me, you have probably encountered that annoying issue where your matrix table columns don't sort the way you want to them, right? Today I'm going to show you how you can solve this problem once and for all with the simple and very effective tricks. So let's dive into it. The problem statement is, if you look at the department, department is represented in the row wise and the columns month and year and these are the value of active employees month month by month within those departments everything looks perfect all right but if you if you look at header of the columns it says april 2006 april 2007 it looks like it is not being sorted by chronological order instead is being sorted by alphabetical order if we want to sort this let's try sort it by visually no it is giving me just department and total active employees there is no way i can sort this by columns which is in my case month and year to overcome this problem we have one simple trick i will show you just now see this is the call this is in fact this is the column i have used there in my matrix i have created one column which is integer equivalent to this year uh, month and year and how I have created, if you look at here, uh, year, month, integer, just I have formatted the date column uh, using the format DAX formula and I have created just year and month. This will give me the integer value and using this, I will sort this month year. So look at here. As of now, there's no sorting. I'll go back. This is very common way to sort this column based upon a numeric one. I'm not doing any magic here. But just be patient with me. I'll show you something. This is my column. Sort by column. I will use this. This particular to sort my column. Now if you go here. The columns are sorted in ascending order. Right. Which is okay for now. At least better than before. These are the my departments. These are the active employees within that department. But here is a problem. To see what are the active employees in my organization as of now I have to scroll it down all across the right most of the matrix table if you could sort this out by descending order then probably we could have seen all those latest number and the leftmost we can achieve this no problem but there is no straightforward I will show you how I have done if you have any better of please mention in the comment of this video my approach is I have created a rank based upon my integer column which I have created already to sort this my month and year and I'll show you what is a formula in here simple rank x formula I have used this is my calendar table right this is a year month integer number which is being used to sort my month year column if you look at the definition of the rank x you will find very easily what what these parameters are and why i have used it so i my 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 requirement was to see those data in the descending order that is why i have used the descending otherwise by default it was it was sorting ascending order and this column I, I have just to show you another uh, table i have created one more column just a copy of the my month year and i'm going to sort this by using rank so we can see what is the difference between two sorting option see remember my this column month and year being sorted by just the integer value of the year month and the month year column descending is being sorted by rank column and look at the magic over here see same thing but i could see my latest value here so i don't need to scroll to see my those latest value if i need to see the older one i can obviously score but look at the difference this is a trick i wanted to show you and if you have any anything better than this you you're most welcome to comment in this video and we can discuss this further and one more request guys if you like my video please like and subscribe and share with your friends so we can learn in our journey and we can be a better power bi developer or better power bi professional thank you very much